guys, welcome back to a short and sweet what I eat in a day. This was a day where I was just at home, working my way through my to-do list. So in this video, I'm sharing with you all the foods from that day, easy, healthy, and quick things to make that hopefully won't get in the way of you being productive. Let's get into it. One of my obsessions lately has been smoothies with cereal. It's so good. Um, yeah, so for this one, add to your blender the following things. Two regular bananas. One cup of frozen strawberries. Quite a few tablespoons of vegan strawberry yogurt. This can also be plain, of course, or vanilla or a coconut. Maybe not chocolate. Blend it all together. And then that's the wonderful thing about these, is that you don't have to get fancy with toppings. Just use your favorite cereal. I used this oat cereal by the brand Kern, which I very much am a fan of. The best brand to get oats from, I love them. What's great is that most of the basic cereals you can find in stores happen to be vegan. Just read the ingredients. So even things like Cinnamon Toast Crunch, or if you're in Germany and you know Nougat Bits. Then I started on trying to be productive. Here's me cleaning the kitchen, taking walks with the dog, packing for travels, Taking a photo of the last recipe that went into my ebook. More on that in just a second. It is a tempeh potato wrap, and I had about half of this and gave the rest to my brother. So I count this as a snack or as lunch number one. A couple hours later, I had my actual lunch, which was two of these toasty thingies. They're like uh, English muffins, but just not as fluffy. I had them with vegan cream cheese and topped them off with tomato and spinach, avocado and microgreens. Quick question, can you guys recommend um, a good vegan cream cheese brand? I have the one that I use and I like it, but I'm sure there's more. I also had the rest of the tomato by the way. And then I moved to the computer for the rest of the day. First I needed tea though, that is essential. And then I responded to emails, did some video editing, I got distracted by YouTube, and continued working on the book. Speaking of the ebook, it will be out on September 30th, 2018. That's the date. I said it. It's actually happening. I'm really proud of this and really hope you guys are gonna like it. Yeah. For a late, late dinner, I had no idea what to make at first, and then I thought it would be smart to use up all the miscellaneous vegetables that we had in the fridge. So let's call this the leftover salad challenge. So here's what I was working with. Baby spinach, leftover cooked potatoes, avocado, red onion, a yellow pepper, um, this lettuce, an old zucchini, some of these walnuts, and nutritional yeast. What I did first was chopping up all the vegetables and then I cooked them using my beloved grill pan. I sauteed them on medium high with a bit of oil and I wasn't too concerned about cooking them all the way through. Took me about six to eight minutes. Don't wanna be weird. It's a direction, thinking wish you were here. Uh -huh. 
So after about 6 to 8 minutes, I added the spinach and I let that wilt down for another 3 minutes or so. To my salad bowl, I added the lettuce first, which wasn't the best of choices. As you can see, I'm adding the veggies on top and since they're still super hot, the lettuce wilts down, which I don't hate, but it's not the best either. So maybe wait for the veggies to cool down or add the lettuce later or don't add lettuce at all. Then I added the potato, avocado, squeezed lemon juice on top, sprinkled over walnuts I had chopped earlier, nutritional yeast, and a couple different spices and salt. I mixed it all together and had about half of this, maybe a bit more than half, maybe two thirds. And I was eating that while watching a bit of Netflix. Yep, that was enough productivity for the day. I'm not really a rom-com person, not at all actually, but to all the boys I've loved before, it's the cutest movie I've ever seen. I get why it's so hyped. It's adorable. It's adorable. And that's it. Hope you guys enjoyed this little peek into my day. More videos coming soon. Also more information about the ebook. Thank you so much for being here. I really, really appreciate it. See you soon, guys. Bye. I got that feeling someone's watching me. Right before I caught you staring. This body language I see you speak. Oh, there's no what's there.